Hello everybody, how are you all doing? Enrique here, and today I'm going to show you how you can fix high RAM memory usage and memory leak from programs. When you open a program application or a game into your PC, this requires some processing power from your CPU and also some RAM memory. What can happen that sometimes the program it doesn't give back the allocated memory that was using completely free again when you close it. To fix that and another high memory RAM usage problems into your PC, you want to go into the search bar right here and to type regedit. And you want to open the registry editor. When you have this open, you want to go into HK local machine, click on the little arrow right here always, go into system, control set 001, and into service. And you want to scroll all the way down until you find NDU right here. Click on it. Now, when you are right here into NDU, you want to go into the start, right click on it, click on modify. You can see the value data right here, right now is 2. You want to change this for 4. Once you have made the changes, click on OK. And now, guys, you can close the registry editor. Another thing that can really help you is to disable Superfetch or Sysmain, like I showed in another video, but I'm going to show you here because it's really fast and easy to do. Click into the search bar, type run, open the application right here, and in here you want to type services.msc. Click on OK. This is going to open your local services, and you want to scroll down all the way to the S, and to search for sysmain, and if you don't have sysmain, you can search for superfetch. Right-click on it, click on properties, and here, into the startup type, you want to change this from automatic to disable. Click on apply, and then OK. Right now, it's still running, as you can see right here, so you want to right-click on it, and to click stop. These two solutions will help to fix the 100% RAM utilization and the high RAM leakage from another program, especially older programs that you can be running into your system. I hope you guys have enjoyed this quick tutorial. Subscribe if you haven't already for more tech tutorials like this one and some tech reviews. Like the video if you like it, dislike if you didn't like it. And I really hope this video have helped you all. By me on the comments down below if you have any questions. I always try to answer you all. So guys, like always, see you in the next time. Bye bye.